landing into London for just the third time in her life. 20-year-old Mary Black, MP. She's the youngest person to be elected to Parliament in nearly 200 years. Hi. But the new baby of the House will be supported by plenty of her SNP colleagues. A record 56 of them headed in for their first day at work. When you started out this campaign, did you ever imagine this moment? Um, no. <laughs> I th th what happened when we started, I thought, oh, obviously it's going to be a really, really hard task. This is a big name in politics and it's a massive majority and you know, it's incredible. Um, but as it was going on and we were chatting more and more doors and you were realising just how angry people were. And they were just saying that they were, they were tired of having a, a system that doesn't, it doesn't care about people. It's, you know, people aren't at the heart of policies, you know, it seems to be that it's, uh, Parliament's filled with out-of-touch people, quite often with business interests. Duly elected. <laughs> Having beaten Labour grandee Douglas Obviously Alexander in one of the more first extraordinary first moments of election night, Miss Black is now determined to shake up Parliament. And I'm genuinely thinking, I'm not the one who should be nervous. The people who are responsible for so much poverty and so much struggle in people's lives, they're the ones who should be nervous because they're the ones that are going to be held accountable for all the, you know, the damage that they've caused to people. But she's already finding herself being held accountable for her social media posts, including colourful language about being drunk. Some of the tweets were posted five years ago. It's embarrassing apart from anything else. You know, I think if any adult thinks of some of the stuff they hit out with when they were 14, then they, they would cringe and it's unfortunately I'm in a position where I suppose there's a record of it they could be dragged out for everyone to see. But to be honest, I, I think most people are seeing that as just, you know, what a... I so you said daftlings as a teenager who didn't, you know. On to the House of Commons. Murray's been here once before as a tourist. This time things are a little bit different. David Cameron said that Parliament feels like a school to him. Do you think this will feel like a school to you? <laughs> it might feel like his school, but my school is a bit different than David Cameron's, I think. You <laughs> can't get them all in anyway. Mary Black is reflective of the new wave of SNP MPs. Many don't appear to conform to the traditional profile of Westminster politicians. Today, Nicola Sturgeon showed them off to the press pack. So the SNP tsunami has hit Westminster. These 56 MPs effectively represent the third party here. And as you can see, they're already causing quite the commotion. Mary is off to find her new office. Next month, she finishes life as a student. Her final exam is on Scottish politics.